Hello and welcome to my channel. We are going to be tackling another vegan recipe. I am a non-vegan, but I love trying these vegan recipes. Um, that's where I got the recipe from. If you want the full, complete, correct recipe. I will be tweaking this a bit. Um, I'm actually adding something that is not on here. I will let you guys know as we go along. But food.com is the right recipe. It is called... Oh, I forgot to put the name. Darn it. I think it's called... Like broccoli... Bro orange... Broccoli stir fry or something like that. But you should find it under food.com. And these are the ingredients and the instructions. I have very sloppy writing. Probably misspelled half of the stuff on here. But let's get started. I really hope you guys don't get a glimpse of what I'm wearing because it's not not acceptable what I'm wearing right now. It's just not acceptable. Okay, so what we're gonna do first is of course we're gonna chop and disinfect our broccoli. Some of this broccoli is looking real bad. I'm gonna make it with rice. Let's put it in water and soak it with a little bit of uh, vinegar. That's how I usually try. The key word here is try, guys. We're all human. We're all sometimes in such a hurry that we just want to get food on the table. And sometimes we do things like this where we're washing them with vinegar. And sometimes we don't. And that's okay. So we finally switched from watching Toy Story for three months in a row to I just purchased Jumanji. So that's what's new here. I really hope this one is not as bad. Please don't be as bad. Because I thought I had another recipe. I must have dreamed about it or something because I went to go look at my folder, my recipe folder, and there was no broccoli recipe in there. And I, when I went to the store, I pur purposely got broccoli thinking I had a recipe already. Like, I don't know. I'm making probably no sense at all. It's kind of hard to find recipes because everything calls for vegan cheese and... I'm not like a 100% vegan here. I did try all kinds of different cheeses and they just were not my, they were not my thing. That was a, That's a hard one for me, the cheese. It's a hard one for me. Milk, I've actually, I'm actually not drinking any more cow milk. Um, not that I'm against it. It just kind of hurts my stomach a little bit. This is so boring. I'm just going to stop talking about it. Do, can you guys, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut like a little, like little pieces of the peel. It also says to grate. Ah, that's good enough. Minced ginger, minced garlic. I don't have sesame oil. I'm just going to use regular oil. Like always, I'm using crusty old stuff that's in the fridge. You guys must think I'm always using like rotten stuff i don't use rotten stuff they're just sometimes a little bit wilted yeah if you guys hear background chaos it's jumanji i have it on in the background how much of this one tablespoon okay so one tablespoon of garlic and you know what i'm gonna use less ginger than what it's asking for because it's asking for a whole tablespoon i think that's a lot but then again that is each individual's taste buds that is each individual's taste buds that makes no sense someone help someone help me with words someone anybody help putting words together and that jumanji movie's loud brought out um i use this liquid aminos if you have soy sauce use soy sauce if you have what is that other stuff called? Tamari or whatever, use that. You do you in your kitchen. You do you. I don't know what that was. I'm just gonna add it. Well, uh, okay, I'll bring out something. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make a little more of the juice because what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna make like a glaze probably I'm probably gonna do about half a cup and then to this 
I'm gonna add, oh my gosh, the orange. Oh my gosh, you can't even see. And to this, I'm gonna be adding cornstarch to make it like a glaze. Ya feel me? So yeah, it's about half a cup. You can do more, it'll just be more glaze. Okay, so here's my broccoli, nice and clean. I'm gonna set it to the side. I'm gonna bring you guys over to the stove in a minute. So that I'm gonna measure because um, I, I've made, I mean half a tablespoon. Does this even have a tablespoon? I'll just do half of this one. Um, I've done the big mistake of not measuring cornstarch or flour when trying to thicken and no. You can, here's my cornstarch. You can use cornstarch, you can use flour, arrowroot or whatever that other stuff is called. So I'm gonna start with about half a tablespoon. Um, mix it and then we'll take it from there once it starts like warming up and stuff. I think this is called a slurry. Is that what this is called? Somebody help with words. Oh, I didn't make a tea today. I usually make tea. It's getting really hot here, so no, 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 no tea. Okay, I'm gonna set you guys over to the stove. Okay, you guys are over at the stove now. Yay. Breakfast shenanigans on this side. Do not pay attention to that. So basically, you just... I don't know, you just saute. Wow, this thing is broken. Yeah. Somebody help. Up. Add the broccoli and we'll continue. So something I forgot. Here's the orange juice with the cornstarch. I forgot to add the soy sauce. So it says one tablespoon of soy sauce. And we'll do that much. Is this hot yet? No, not hot yet. Don't you hate that? You think it's hot, you think you're cool, and then you're like, nothing, nothing, no noise, nothing, no sizzle. I make something very similar to this using chicken and all kinds of veggies and pair it with rice. Oh, speaking of rice, I still gotta put the rice. Use this short grain rice that I've had for a while. Okay, so there is the rice. I'm just gonna make it plain. I'm just gonna add just a touch of salt, just like a touch. Okay, this is sizzling, so let's add it. We'll just stir it until you feel like you like it. Some people, some people like their broccoli uh, very crunchy. Other people like it really soft. You just, you just do it to whatever you like. You know. It's your kitchen, you do your rules. Okay. Yes, I put my hands on my food. Okay, because you're not going to eat it. Of my wonderful fashion. Yeah. You see, you see, blue, pink, come on. You know you're jealous. You know you're jealous. Add the ginger, the garlic, and the orange peel for a couple minutes. Okay. This is really fast. And it's very filling because you put it on top of some rice and mmm. When I taste it, I'm going to be nice and showered. That way I don't look like a hot mess when I'm tasting the food. Even though I still look like a hot mess, it's all right. You feel me. At least I won't be a dirty hot mess. You can't really go wrong with adding the cornstarch. To this recipe because wait is cornstarch corn vegan yeah right is it vegan punch me in the face if it's not you could probably even add like some cashews in here some peanuts i only have yeah i don't have any any of the above and i'm actually running kind of low on vegetables so i'm not gonna add anything i just think Broccoli is so hearty. I think I'm gonna put a lid on this. Cause guys, TMI, but the indigestion with raw broccoli in my stomach is real. I'm the type of person that just grabs any lid. I don't take my time to look for the correct, I don't even think this has a lid. There you go. It is gonna be good. Guys, I'm just looking at the picture, I mean at the recipe. And it says I'm supposed to grate ginger, I mean ginger, the orange peel. 
let me go grate some because on the picture it didn't show i don't know the picture was a little different than what it's describing but let me go grate some i'm not even gonna bother to look for a lid this will do directly on top if you don't have a grater i think you can just uh you can just use the peels i mean on the picture it just shows peels it doesn't really look like it has we'll eat this orange later let's put the peels in there let's put the ginger and the garlic very nice so far it's smelling divine you really don't want to see this in full form you really trust me you just really don't and let's not even let's not even get started with the hair situation going on right now all right so i think it's been one or two minutes now let's throw this in yes in it um of course if you want it to be like more saucy more you know you can add more orange you can even add a little bit of water make it to your uh liking but this is looking very promising guys i just don't know if i would have just added the orange like the recipe says would it have been too brothy maybe not because it only asked for a fourth a cup so i don't know guys all right guys here is what i am going to do i am going to add another half of an orange because i feel like it needs to be a little more saucy and oh something smells like burnt adding a little more cornstarch something smells like something smells like burnt i should have added the here what am i doing is this what's smelling like burnt probably that's not even the right lid either oh well it'll work better than this i think this is kind of burning okay where's the slurry okay so we're just gonna mix it all up i added about another half a tablespoon in here but i'm gonna add like slowly it's just one of those things that everybody likes their sauce different some people like it a little more watery a lot some people like it thicker i'm just gonna add until the consistency is right for me it's not too thick it's not too thin it's not like water I like it. I'm going to turn it off and I am done with the broccoli part. We're just waiting on the rice. And I didn't end up adding the whole thing. Here's still some. So, take what you can from that. I know it's confusing because I don't use measurements. I just go by what I see and what I like. Well, guys, we are here. My kids are hungry and I still haven't showered. And this was like perfect amount of rice. I think I did half a cup of rice and this is going to be perfect just for us to eat right now with this yumminess i'm not gonna lie to you guys we already tried it and guys this is delicious it is probably one of the best recipes that i've done so far on my channel it is just to die for look at how good that looks like come on again yummy